Officers say you are barking up the wrong tree if you plan on committing a crime at a Johnson County dog park. This, this after a report of two suspicious men lurking around the area. Officers want to caution pet owners as a result. The Niles Ray Daniels shows us how officers are taking puppy playtime seriously. Every day, Vicki Barker and her dog Zoe make their way to Shawnee Mission Dog Park. So we have 62 acres that we can wander through. The large park brings several people in. She usually has about two dozen dogs that she likes to run and play with. As the weather warms up, some people aren't always there for the same reason. If we see someone in the park that don't have a dog, it's like stranger danger. Just this week, one woman reported to police two suspicious men who had no dogs kept following her, making her feel uncomfortable. She actually did, I think, exactly what she should have done. She got herself to a safe situation and, and put herself in that safe situation, and she was vigilant. She trusted her instincts, and that's exactly what everybody ought to do. That's why police are taking extra precaution. So really, they have the protection, not only the park police, but the Lenox and Shawnee Park Police as well, and it's really very well covered. We will cover it with bike patrols, foot patrols, and of course in cars as well. Police encourage you to let someone know where you'll be, trust your instincts, and travel in packs. That's how we've all got to know one another. Our, either our dogs have started playing together, or we just say, do you mind if I walk with you? While cautious, Barker says it's not going to keep her from coming to play with her best friend. Good girl. In Shawnee, Ray Daniel for the Now KC. And it's also the time of year when car burglaries go up. So if you head to the dog parks, travel light, lock your car doors and make sure your valuables are out of sight.